Felicia and Tiffany, what makes these two deaths even more heart wrenching is today is a National Law Enforcement Appreciation Day. Here in Orlando, police say that Mon Keith Alloyd shot Master Sergeant Deborah Clayton three times when she confronted him outside of this Walmart early this morning. Now, Sergeant Clayton was reportedly putting bags in her trunk, fully uniformed at her car when a customer walked up and told her a wanted man was inside the store. The confrontation happened just moments later when she was shot by uh, Lloyd. Lloyd is wanted for allegedly killing his pregnant girlfriend last month. The shooting outside this Walmart was just the start of the violence. A sheriff's deputy was struck and killed by an SUV while responding to the shooting. And another deputy was fired at while trying to stop Lloyd's getaway vehicle. Sadly, I have to share with you this morning that in my uh, nearly 36 year career, this is probably one of the toughest days for me in my career. Because not only did we lose an Orlando police officer today, we lost an Orange County Deputy Sheriff as well, who was uh, traveling uh, on his motorcycle as a result of these broad uh, efforts that we have underway. Police records show Sergeant Clayton was one of the first officers who responded to the Pulse nightclub shooting last June, arriving minutes after 911 calls came in about shots fired there. Right now, police are warning everyone that Monkeith Lloyd, Marquise Lloyd, is extremely dangerous and armed. If you do see him, uh, do not approach him, but instead call 911. There is also a $60,000 reward being offered for information leading to his capture, and they have also said that they will jail and charge anyone who is helping him hide and they will go to the ends of the earth to bring this wanted suspect in. We'll be back with more at six for now live in Orlando. I'm Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.